here we are riding now on a motorbike which is, has a seat like this and it costs about same as a car but it can get you much more faster to the location because of the jam around the area so we are going now to a night market and um, Pandey does the best food they have here Hello. Well, as you see how the people drive here and the only thing you have to do is, here is honk and honk and honk On our recent trip to Medan, Indonesia, like any major other city, congestion has become an increasingly acute problem in Medan. Medan is faced with a growing problem of congestion and poor air quality. The city reliance on cars have threatened to create a cloud over the vibrant city, which as well makes it hard for us as a pedestrian to move around. Even though there is a lot of honking, Medan requires a skillful driver to overcome the traffic and the hustle of instance just to go to the traffic flow. So yeah, here is the traffic and we are stuck. And it's raining. And the more it rains, the, the hotter it gets. Hey. First durian in here. Mm, nice. Much more um, juicier and um, sweeter. So now we are on the way to Lake Toba. It's uh, one of the biggest lake in Southeast Asia that is having um, volcanic eruption as a volcano uh, rock there located right inside the lake so it's also surrounded by 12, uh, 12 waterfalls so stay tuned and follow all our trip through that
we are on the way to the island. Uh, fortunately, we couldn't get it through because all the ferries were not available at that point of time. And they said for only for two people, it's not really efficient for them. So we had to pay for the ferry to get inside our car here. And here we are on the way to there. So, ah, so I guess the island is over there, that side. Hey. <laughs> So yeah, I think the island will be on the over on that side. So we are taking this ferry with a lot of cars on inside here, and uh, hopefully we'll be here there around 45 minutes. But it's actually slower than the normal ferry. So I don't know. the biggest uh, biggest volcanic uh, eruption island which is affecting uh, which is uh, affecting the weather and, uh, and the global warming actually. so based on this eruption which happened 7,000 years ago it affected all uh, it affected all the weather weather condition so it turned into ice age yeah. did you know that did you know that it's actually affecting the, uh, this er volcanic eruption affected the uh, turning at the ice age all the world to the ice age to margaria it's a million years ago yeah. <laughs> actually those kids are so brave <laughs>
a feeling here. Why, why tomorrow are we hiking? Huh? Why are we hiking tomorrow? Let's go breast I hmm? mean, we're going to like hilly hilly one, right? I think. Should I get me? <laughs> <laughs> 